Yeah, I had some trouble over the weekend with uh, with my Windows apps directory, so I had to reinstall. Hopefully, all my things are here. Yay! That definitely looks like my character. Okay, go to the Cosmodrome. Is that really the thing I need to do now? Yeah, I actually think it is. Go right, take the train to Thames Gate. I think I need to go down a level or something. Oh, there it is. Oh, nah, really? To Sam's Gate. Oh, well, there are the T-Pose right now. RPG, Commander, I've got the cannon, the turret here, and Mono Ranger and Life Transfer. The short guys are tough, but it looks like the big ones I can handle. Maybe I should switch out for something that can do energy damage. Digital damage. Also, I've been recommended to use this. Enforcer. Energy burst rifle. The superior is known as the assault rifle. Yeah, I like it better. Burst rifles, uh, homing bullets. And I realize I can do this. Thank you. For letting me know. Ah, uh, great. I got it. A freight 
Falcon is registered to Suntor Klein Corp. Just made a rapid departure request. Suntor Klein is an OV front. We can assume the shipping master is on board. What's worse, that pinnace is not just a planet hopper. It's an interstellar vessel. If it leaves Velez, we'll never get our hands on the shipping master. You must stop it. Um, getting down. Someone wants to give me a quest. Can't hack him. That's a robot. Yeah, I've been here before. Well, is the goddamn quest giver? Okay, where are we going? Oh, I forgot about the button that's supposed to show me where to go. You know, the cyberdeck, tactical, swap, augmentation, interact, mission HUD, call taxi. I don't have that button. I'm annoyed at this. Maybe. Is 
the camera moving weirdly. Moving. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. Bullets. I suggest a pincer maneuver. Docking bay gate control terminal located. Destination set. Shut the docking bay gate. direct ship. Well, you bought this on yourself. Can't feel my legs. If it is a pain, you are doubling. Just help me get out of here. Caution. The fire is about to reach the ship fuel distribution valves. Your weak flesh will be burnt to a crisp when that happens. I advise rapid movement. How was those tiny legs support that huge frame of yours? Fuck. I gather you didn't get the data. Who the hell are you people? What do you want? The shipments you made to the Ascent Group. Speak. Uh. <coughs> Why? What's in it for me, huh? Well, how about not spending a perceived eternity in the Null exploring all possible and probable types of pain? Bring it on, you foreign bitch! 
I got enough black ice in here to fry whatever you jack me into. Yes, well, we'll see about that. Another assignment completed. I admire your resourcefulness. Seems there are sapiens who deviate from the species' substandard norm. Now we should leave. About 20 Onyx Void Flatliners are heading this way, stimmed up and itching to pulp us. I prefer facing them at a different time and place. We will contact you as soon as we've extracted the data we need from this... thing. You're welcome. The Shipping Master. The Onyx Void Shipping Master is the living repository of all their transportation and data and ongoing contracts with different affiliates. Oh, Kira praised me. As a rare desync mnemonic, he is very aware of his status and importance within the organization. Havoc. The X-28 Havoc is a combat platform designed for speed, mobility and area denial. A favorite with the Volpine drop troops. These airborne drones are not just fast and agile, but also quite lethal when the spray missiles come into play. Remember to look up. Barrage. Victory through the use of superior firepower. This axiom is effectively demonstrated by the Larkian Barrage, who carries a vehicle mounted minigun with ease. When facing these trigger happy support gunners, it's wise to stick to covers to avoid having your precious body disintegrated by a hail of tungsten tipped bullets. Is that thing attached to his arm? No, he's holding a trigger. Okay. Completed the foreign code. I want that. So let's get out of this. Wait, are there any things to loot here? But nothing here shows me the uh, the cooldown on this ability. Operative, we have news. Come see us at cluster thirteen. Give me a minute, I'm gonna do some side quests. Oh, it's over there. Thank you. Volcanic brim. And there's one over here. back. Well, I picked up two bounties, should pay for a taxi ride. Oh, right. That's what the green means. What's that? Enter what? 
Give me a minute. Fine, let's see what it means. Where the hell am I? Where the hell am I? Oh, screw that. Let's get back to business. Um, this is... This is well. It's not here. Also not here. Stim town. Where the hell that is? Exotic dinner. It's all very, very much not here. Okay, let's get back to cluster 13. Currently inside interior cannot call taxi. Uh, ecology, I guess. And I need that elevator. Okay, that's cluster 13. That's not here, not here. One more rep. Let's do that. Hey, I'm trying to keep it civil. You have careers. Wait, will the metal be faster?
Sorry. Senders, we are preparing. Yeah, they're no match for me anymore. Oh yeah, I've already been here and the thing is missing. Yeah, I have no idea how to get there. What's with all the other quest givers? Let's refocus. Same guy. It's also passive in my wildest expectations. These little fellas will change the world. You have my everlasting gratitude. I did not foresee them to be so attractive to ferals, but that's science for you. Always expect the unexpected. I've added a little something to your world as a compensation for the dangers you faced. I thank you. Progress thanks you. Okay. Cool. Wait, so do you want something else? That's not here, not here, not here. What was the way down? They're not serenity, right? they're not here. They're over there. Right. 
There you are. That head you brought us held a few info gems beneath multiple layers of bullshit and surprisingly aggressive ice. <sighs> the Ascent Group contracted Onyx Void to smuggle prominent scientists and exotic materials from all over the sector onto Velez. All of it tied to a secret project. You must find those scientists. We dug out a potential lead from the head, a sapiens female named Laura Lania. The Ascent Group personnel files list her as a Class 3 HR manager, but her contact info has been irretrievably purged. She received the scientists from OV. The surveillance probe showed Lania frequenting several establishments in Stimtown. Talk to the bartenders and regulars there and see if any of them know more of her current whereabouts. Find Lania and you'll find the scientists. Questions? I'm sure she's just a facilitator without any tangible knowledge. But by locating the scientists, we should learn more about the project they worked on. Questions? It's where you indents go for stress relief, isn't it? I'm sure you know more about it than I do. Questions? We are less interested in the missing scientists than in what they were brought in to work on. The Ascent Group went through considerable pains to acquire and hide them from all rivals. Questions? No, I'm done. Updated. Okay. Trace protocol, new mission. What? Where is it? Why? No, I won't tell you how. But I can help you with stim town access. Come see me and we'll talk. Fine. You look like a potential scalp. One less scum. Oh, another one. One less scumbag. Yay! Four taxi rides paid for. Well, well. If it isn't my former handyman, come fucking rock star. You said something about Steam Town Nexus? Oh, the sweet irony. Here you are, two timing as a damn CGT operative for whatever mystery corp that sly of foreign represents, and you can't even get into Steam Town for a stiff one? You've come a long way, but you still depend on me, huh? What do you want? Well, you're in luck, because I need an errand runner. There's a bartender named Spice over at the loading bars expecting a delivery from me. They don't like to admit it, but most of the proprietors over there depend on my goodwill. Now this delivery will be frowned upon if it was discovered, but it'll get you through the lockdown. I have an arrangement with a guard named Wharton. Let him know I sent you and he'll let you through. Get the package delivered to Spice and you'll have your access. And remember, you owe me. We'll just let that simmer for a while. Now get out of here before I lose my appetite, you backstabbing bastard! Hey, I do a side for me. For a minute I thought it was a one-handed guy with a bat.
Welcome to the danger zone. See that earlier. That could explain some things. No entry. Boon sent me. Stake boss Poon. Again? Fuck. I've paid my fucking dues to him ten times over already. Don't ever indebt yourself to a jack lad. Oh well, come on through. And let that bastard know I've had enough of his favours. After this, we're even. I'm giving you permanent access, Yay. so I don't have to bother with your face again. Great, don't want to bother with your face either. Warden, former Corpsack officer who now guards the entrance to Stimtown, has corrupt now as when he was with Corpsack and has an ongoing arrangement with Stack Boss Boon. Ascender Combatants. The Ascenders are the enthusiastic members of the Ascent Group Corporate Fan Club, urged on by powerful influencers and firm believers in the Ascent Group's inherent exceptionalism. They're ready to keep fighting for that which has seemingly already died. What they lack in combat skills, they more than make up for with surprisingly high quality gear. Nug Engineers. These highly experienced Carlins don't just Tinker with existing stuff, they design and create state-of-the-art weapons and equipment, which they will happily use to flatline your sorry ass. But don't worry, there's no shame in being killed by a two-foot alien with oversized ears. Nope. Just stop calling me flesh. Who wants to talk? That guy. F the chef in this entire establishment. I came here all the time. I'm a good customer, the best he's got. Listen, this is by far the most delicious soup I've ever had in my entire life, and he refuses to tell me the secret. We shouldn't keep secrets. I'm sure that tight fisted chef has the recipe lying around somewhere. I got his hab number, but I'm not the break in type. Looks like you might care less about locked doors, care to have gourmet in need. It's stupid, I hate it, but sure. <coughs> Good, I happen to have a dynamic keycard. All it needs is the loving touch of a data broker and it should get you inside. I met Flamingo's got a brokerage operation set up in cluster 13. He'll fix the card for you. Then get me that recipe. Nice. No. Alright, let me in. Oh, you again. My lucky day. Wait, what? The last shipment was too strong. 
Oh shit, I warned you, didn't I? Go easy, I said, didn't I? People never listen. Never ever listen. We'll find them. Here, try this cut batch instead. It's not nearly as potent as the last batch, but it'll still do the job. In fact, it might even be perfect for a guy like you. What's that? It's for the Carlins. Yeah, sure man, whatever you gotta tell us after sleep at night. Anyway, take this shit and get the F out of here. And remember, you don't know me, I don't know you, and this never happened. I mean, I'm trying to go unnoticed here, get me? Sure. I see... Another pickup. Club? Name your poison, friend. Package. Well, looky here. Poon actually came through. Give him my thanks. Now. What can I do you for? Stiff one. Sure. Coming up. This could frizzle your wiring, buddy. Lenny. Hmm. Rings a bell. There's a mid boss who came here slumming every once in a while. She's not welcome here anymore, though. Why? Couldn't keep her hands up the other clientele. Gave her two passes, but she struck out on the third. I bet you can find her at the dirty dive. They're less picky with their customs. Yeah, you know, when the uppers come down here to sample the forbidden fruit. Fucking tourists, if you ask me. But I don't say no to their Ucreds. What's the dirty dive? It says it all, doesn't it? It's not far from here. Sure thing, friend. Just give a shout if you need something. Thanks, bye. Okay, thanks, bye. Neutron beam. Yeah, I wanted to try that one out. Propulsion leap. Huh. Let's try that. We have a speed heal mod. Get extra health for all healing pickups and abilities, heal faster, heal better, stay alive. Hmm. But a vital sign booster. Fine, right, we'll try. I have a skill point. Hmm. Hmm. Slightly lower energy damage. Lower life signs, higher energy. Volcanic brim. More digital protection. More tactical sense. Nah. Stim town. This map is getting confusing. Dirty dive. So that guy came in again last night, fourth time this week, and it's only Wednesday. Man got good and effed. Start unloading on the bar, using the bottles for target practice. 
when he stopped only when he ran out of ammo and then he just traded bullets for fists, which somehow was even worse. Someone's gonna put a stop to this guy or we're gonna be out of business here and that right soon. Who left the fist? The fist, ballistic shotgun. Wait, where was the guy with the side quest? Did Frank send you in? Well, whatever. Well, good either way. Clearly you're the one we've been looking for. See, we got this guy in Og from Melhorst. Melhorst Gelb keeps tearing shit up every time he rolls on through here. And this dude, let me tell you, he's not like the others. He's bad news. Real bad. Like blowing shit up night after night. We need him taken care of, if you know what I mean. Of course, the problem is he actually doesn't technically broken the law, so that's where it gets a little tricky. I mean, you gotta toe the line with those cult guys. No bodies on his head, nothing we can do. You, on the other hand, if you were to bump into him somewhere, say, oh, so accidentally, maybe pick a fight, well, who knows what might happen. How about it? Sure. Oh, thank god, I was hoping you'd say that. This guy has got a kind of home base by the edge. Head on up there and take him down. Look out though, he's chromed Major Ogs enhancements up the ass, so be ready to go all in on this one. And hey, if you make the problem go away, who knows what you might get in return. Sure. New mission, that guy. And you're lonely, I can tell. Buy me a kick? Thanks, hon. That's sweet of you. Lanyo. And here we were having such a good time. Why bring up that bitch? Alright. So we used to go out for a while. She had you creds, used to brag about her crib up in A stack, some penthouse do. Bitch. Dumped me like yesterday's trash when she started hanging out with the quicks. Good riddance. A stack? AKA Blossom Hill. Fancy name for a sad fucking building. I hear the quicks have the run of the place now. What about them? Not local, are you, hon? The liquid quicks? Pretty easy going unless you cross them. Can't see what the hell she saw in them. Tense flatliner named Trenning is leading them these days. He'll know her for sure. Thank you. Thanks for the kick. And if you find her, tell her to go fuck herself. I will. Palu. Steamtown fun boy addicted to kicks and recently coming out of an unhealthy relationship. Bozeman. Bozeman is regular at the Dirty Dive, a bar so named for its immaculate appearance. World class service and commitment to utilizing only the finest ingredients in its beautifully crafted handmade artisanal cocktails. What's that you say? You've been there and the place is in fact the filthiest shithole you've ever seen? Well, far be it from us to argue, though our man Bozeman might want to have a word, as his beloved Dirty Dive is his home away from home, his Sanctum Sanctorum, the place where he goes to find a little good cheer after a long hard day's work. That is, until the F-head started showing up and raising all kinds of hell. Yeah, that's right, the overly augmented, chromed out dickwad known to all simply as that guy coming on in, overturning tables, chasing out customers, and generally causing all kinds of ruckus. Our Bozeman, well, he doesn't like anything getting in the way of between him and his drink, so it looks like you might have to step on up and talk to that guy for him. Oh, I'm sorry, was there in your way? I really should watch where I'm standing. What a terrible, terrible cycle, but at least I'm still alive. That's always something to be thankful for. But I shouldn't burn you in my woes. Are you sure you want to, you want me to, me to share? Uh, sorry, I clicked the wrong button. 
Oh, you're back. Have you decided to lend your ear to my misery? Sure. Oh, how kind. My story is a terrible one. I'm Ivan. Yes, I almost, I was almost poisoned, you see. A most unfortunate mishap. But do not be alarmed. I still have my health, though I can't say the same for my poor Grizzle. He drank the poison in my stead. Always hungry and thirsty was poor Grizzle. He was a prized fighter in the carnage cage, too. Ugh. I trained him myself, for what, when he was a vicious little mutie, to the crazed, slavering beast he became. The times we had. Kaiser first really should give me a new pup. It's the very least he can do after poisoning Grizzle. But I was never good at confrontations. She's puking a lot. But you, you look like one for whom confrontations happen every day, to your advantage. Maybe if you asked Kaiser to replace Crystal for me, he might listen. After all, Kaiser's the one who tried to poison me in the first place for not selling Crystal to him. You're not a carnage cage over in the grinder. Don't hesitate to use all your powers of persuasion, my humble thanks. The champ. I'm doing this for Crystal, not for you. What? Where's the collectible? I want a collectible. Advanced component. Wait, well, how do I? Why, why difficult? Devil jacket. Mm. Not very speedy or devilly. I prefer looking like a tank. You know, you really don't look like you belong here. Hey, wait a sec. Maybe you can help us out. Sure. So my babies have been getting all broken up here. Things been what they are and all. <laughs> so my customers have been getting a little, shall we say, over ego. Parts getting all worn down real bad and, well, kind of effed up, honestly. I usually get a shipment from Grigori in the node, but you know, state of the world and all, that just ain't happening right now. So yeah, can you hit up Grigori for the latest shipment? Go get me some brand new babies. I'll give you something real nice in return. Count on it. Sure. Oh well.
Come again? Sal sent you? He wants what? For a soup recipe? He's insane. Must be a damn tasty soup. Here, I fixed the kicker that you can just waltz through that door. Isn't waltz with a T and a Z? So I better invite us over for some soup when it's done. Damn it, he's below me. Sounds like ungrateful Abbott. Oh yes, she. And right on time too. Did you bring the stuff? New and improved. Ah yes, it's all here. Fantastic. Now we can get the Carlins and everyone else in here too. Maybe get a little diversity going on. Diversity is good. I mean, the Larkins are fine and all, but I want to train everyone. You know. I want everyone to have the same shot at getting pumped, not just the big guys. There you go, all yells. Maybe lifting is not your thing, that's fine, but this AUG should help you out, get you pumped in no time. AUG? What? Oh, leveled up too. Okay, what AUG? Overclock, increase energy regeneration, tactical recharge, and reload speed. Huh. Increased by biometrics. Where am I going? Wait. Not him yet. But I can sell stuff to you. No, I want to sell, damn it. Using the enforcer. Yeah, I don't want the superior. I don't want the fist. 200 credits, yay! I don't want the protector. I think I will try the room sweeper. As the fire is an energy pistol, 1000 DPS. If I can hit with it. Maybe there's a better RPG somewhere. All shot is a precision ballistic rifle. Wait, did I sell everything? No. Give me something to Yeah, I sold everything. Do you have anything interesting to buy? Spider bots. Bio converter.
Don't I have the spider bots? I have spider bots. Speed heal, digital thorn, tactical charge. Hmm. Blossom Hill. This is a reminder that the maintenance sector is to be accessed by authorized personnel. Yeah, that push over us. Oh, did I blow up the did I blow up the car? I'm sorry. Not sorry. Where is that thing? Blossom Hills, or a stack like its many siblings, is a large habitation stack with a multitude of apartments of various sizes, by far the most common one being the folding bed studio type. When a stack was first built, a large mural of, hill, of a hill covered with bright flowers was commissioned in order to inspire worker morale, but the budget only allowed for two thirds of the mural to be finished, and the once bright flowers have long since lost their luster. Like the other stacks in the cluster, A stack also suffers from gang warfare, and the current top ferals in the stack are known as the Liquid Quicks. Steam Town is where the denizens of the Warrens and adjacent zones go to generate or blow off steam. Here you'll find every whim catered to, every city desire satisfied, and at a reasonable price compared to the posher upper levels, where few Steam Town carousers would be allowed anyway. What started as a local automated food dispensary and general socializing area when the stacks were first erected soon became a go-to place for those seeking intoxication, deprivation, or just hanging out with friends. As the place gained notoriety, CorpSec would occasionally come to shut the whole thing down, but this ended up causing such massive riots in the world that the local CorpSec commander decided to let Stintown be for the foreseeable future. The fact that he since enjoys gratuitous services at all establishments probably aided his decision. Intensely lethal. 
to Specs. Who the F does he think he is? Sure, this place is safe for now, but why aren't we pushing back harder at the Turbo Vipers? I don't know, man. Still think it's time for a new leader, if you know what I mean. You are the one who's been asking about Lamia. You're lucky that backstabbing board owes me creds, or you'd be stripped for Ogs and Orgs by now. Why do you want to know? Well, but Lania has a penthouse in his very stack. Must have made premium creds on that little side business of hers. I'll go up there and sell things myself, but we got our hands full with those turbo viper fucks. To show you? We had an arrangement. Now and then she'll need someone brought through the district without Corpsec being the wife, right? Or anyone else for that matter. So we'd use the yeast containers. Normally they go to the Ponic farms, but the specials went into storage. No clue what happened after that. She still owes us for the last transport. Was it someone? I didn't ask, she didn't tell. Sentience is all I can tell you. You could hear them moaning and mumbling in there. Hmm. Double vehicles? Don't fucking get me started. We're gonna flatline a lot of them if they don't back off. If you do find her, tell her the quicks don't forget. Training. Training has led the Liquid Quicks for almost a full standard, which stands as a testament to his survival skills in the Warrens. He is a low hab gang boss, well aware of the dangers of his chosen occupation. Street smart and ruthless, he has so far managed to outlive several rivals due to a healthy combination of paranoia and propensity for ultraviolence. Flamingo. Data brokers are a dime a dozen in the arcology, and most of them deal in subversive code on the side. Some maintain a close relationship with a select number of clients, while others offer their services to any customer with a healthy UCRED stash. Flamingo runs a brokerage in Cluster 13, and he is of a sort to maintain a tighter clientele as a way to stay under Corpsex's radar. Note that Corpsex matter much not of course of matter much anymore, but old habits die hard. Flamingo is also a close friend of Salmon, ever since the two of them ran a scavenger shop near Thames Gate back in the days. Hey, wait a sec, look like you can hold your own, maybe. Fact is, we could use your help. Thing is, my boys, the Liquid Quinks, we're losing ground here. We've held this place for years, see? It's our home. You know that phrase, a rose by any other name would smell as sweet? Well, it's all bullshit. We got our rose, the glittering rose, apartment complex, to be precise. And they took it from us. We want it back. It's ours, and ain't no other building gonna do. So can you help us or what? Killing more gang members? Sure. See, I knew you were looking to tussle. The bad guys, yeah, that's right, I said it. The turbo vipers, they've been edging in here for some time now. Mixing it up in our shit. We put up with it for a while, cause you know, we was trying to keep the peace, or at least, that was the plan. Of course, it's like, give an inch, take a mile, so next thing we know, they've taken over the roads. In our home for like, a generation. Well, I say, Blossom Hill is our territory, the Glittering Rose is our home, and ain't no one's gonna tell us otherwise. We tried playing nice, and look where we got us. So now we gotta lay down the law. And by me, I mean you. Get what I'm saying? The two bows are all holed up in the Glittering Rose as of right now, easy enough to find. Head on over there and take care of business. Come back here when you're done. That is a dreadful situation. Wait, so this is over there. And if we go with a dreadful situation, it's closer. Sector supremacy currently claimed by the Turbo Viper Gang. Suggestion. Appear harmless or very aggressive to minimize risk of violent confrontation. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry, it's over there.
might be a kill for too long. Ow! Don't shoot me, I'm helping you. All the health mods. God damn it. Not what I needed. Oof! Damn, that was a tough one. Mm -hmm. 
Notice, this is to let you know that your rent is overdue by five cycles. If rent has not been paid within the next five cycles, you will be evicted and your belongings recycled. If the rent has already been paid, you make no this notice. This area has been slated for rezoning by the stack cluster management team. Demolition will commence in five cycles. All HAP units are to be evacuated. Your sent group will not provide you with new lodgings. Awesome! Oh, it's outside. <laughs> I was just being silly. He's 26. I'm 18. Let's up the critical chance. No, I want I want more uh, biometrics. I think definitely up my health. You did it! You retook the rose. That's amazing. You brought the law. See, I knew you were the man for the job. Woman. Feels good, doesn't it? Giving property back to its rightful owners? Yeah, sure. Now people can have their homes back again. I finally... We can fix this place up, start making improvements. Maybe the building will finally live up to its namesake. I mean, think about it. We improve the building, then that improves the block. We improve the block, that affects the neighborhood. And the city, the world! Get me? You claim the space where you live, you say, this is my patch of ground, my place in this world, this is mine, and no one's gonna take it from me. And then you make that place as beautiful as you possibly can. And that, my man, affects everything. I can get behind that. What is this dreadful situation? In the umbilical. Why isn't it pointing up? The champ. Chef's hab. In the grinder. The recipe. Oh, the, cha the carnage cage. This is the recipe. Okay. Actually, let's try something. Give me the ball shot.
fell. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be having the same effect. Just trying to perform some B and E. What's with all the hassling? Right, all my charges are full. Overriding door lockdown. No override needed. Door already unlocked. Right. Biometrics match those of employee number 0381945V, Laura Lanier. Hmm. Messily. I have a suggestion. Access the HAP surveillance system. It should have recorded what happened here. Maybe there's some graphic footage from my collection. The surveillance terminal should be accessible from somewhere on the floor. Super creepy. This habitation space was clearly decorated by a being with no aesthetic sense. The color combinations are corrupting my code. The course is a marked improvement. Okay. Two twenty eight A, a lanyard. The A security office. Manta D picked up. 
I think... I think... I think this opens a chest? No. I don't remember. Those eyes too? One hit point. Uh, give me more tactical charge. No, give me more evasion. Ready for A, Vecna, oh. Chef Wagner R. Chef Wagner has gained some local fame for his delicious clone clam chowder, the recipe for which he keeps a closely guarded secret. The soup is so tasty that many who try it find it quite hard to stop eating, and some speculate that he spices it with stims. Be that as it may, should anyone else acquire the recipe somehow, Chef Wagner will soon sink back into obscurity again, as he has little less to offer. His tender sausages are anything but, and the few customers who have dared to try the mystery meat have all ended up in sickbay. Fouch is the owner of Plug and Play, a sex bot brothel. Not exactly what he prints on his business cards, which instead say purveyor of extraordinary experiences, but who are we to judge? Fact is, Fouch has been known to do a tidy business these past few years, servicing clients from all over the galaxy, rich, poor, subtle, savage, whatever you taste, whatever your pleasure, Fouch has a bot ready and waiting to see to your every pervy need. Desire and fantasy. Well, at least he did. Nowadays his army of pleasure providers is looking a little worse for wear. Some of these bots, specifically certain parts of said bots, have definitely taken a beating. And so Fouch needs you to see his guy about some replacements. Do it for the common man. As the saying goes, lust will not keep. Something must be done about it. Senders, we are preparing a new round of exciting user tests. Sign up and to get neutral globes, electro blue tissues, duvet, the floral one, insta rinse, K12 pills, 5,000 rounds of caseless 6 mm <laughs> Hey, Red Bulbers are playing loading tonight. Me and John, Jonu are going. Why don't you join? I think John likes you. It's a nice apartment. And rather messy. Chapter 4 The Heist. Hmm. Hey, I remember that you've been talking about wanting more exotic recipes on your menu rotation, and there's this data broker high up that owed me for helping his sister. I called him the favor to get this from Offworld. Now you owe me. Can't wait to hear back from you and tell me how it went down with your clientele. Take care. Dennis out. Yay, water! Return to cell. Well, it says exit. What was the exit? Maybe I can open this now? No. Basic component. Sure. Oh. 
See? No civilian casualties. Give me a flicking minute. Now I need to get more charges. Pushovers. Give me the launcher and let's try room sweeper for a bit. That's pretty effective. Okay, that was something. Thank <laughs> you. 
pleb? Why do people keep calling me pleb? Finally, thanks. Now let's see. Of course, with this, it's time for some entrepreneurship. Was it really stems? That guy is over there. Plug and play is up top. The champ is in the grinder. My main mission is in Blossom Hill. Can I take a taxi to Blossom Hill? Yeah, I can. Hmm. <laughs> I need to finish up. Wait, didn't I do the work for you? You know the Vipers, yeah? The Apathy Fs for cluster 9. Just learned of a way we can one-up them. Would land us in a good standing with the top dogs. And of course, there's a bit of cash in it. You in? Sure. Yeah, you want it. Alright, I can see that. This is what gives. Turbo's got a shipment of blue snooze. Fresh tint, supposedly the most potent yet. We're gonna make the Vipers everyone's best mates. Except we're gonna grab it first, or you are. And maybe you'll get to flatline some of them cocky Fs while you're at it. Once you get the goods, you're gonna deliver it to our associates in Stimtown and Corp Zone. The Vipers will lose face. The Quicks will gain cred. OV will understand that we mean business. And you'll get properly paid. Package is over at Viper Run Warehouse at the Drome. I've pushed the delivery contacts to your imp. Happy flatlining. Okay. Sigola hates clouds and is quite paranoid, so you'll probably find him in the dream world, Lou. Yes, very discreet. Okay, I'll just do that main mission. Krog. A lieutenant with the liquid quicks and training his right hand. Krog is in charge of the gang's import-export business and connected endeavors. Humble Ivan is a veteran of the Carnage Cage circuit, and supposedly he has had quite a few fells contending in the bloody matches over the last decade, but lately he seems to have run afoul of the Kaisers for reasons he'd be happy to share over a kick or two. No, it's just not me not caring very much. People are running into my line of fire! Yeah, I think most of all this thing stun locks if I hit.
Damn. What am I doing here again? Oh, right. Accessing surveillance footage. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Such clarity, Flesh. I am endlessly fascinated by seeing misplaced bodily fluids. Bracketing relevant sequence. And... There you go. I saved a copy for my own enjoyment as well. Right. Indent something something. Lots of indents. Armed, lots of armed people. Weapons. Seems so explodable. charge.
G92 EMB grenade. Okay, let's do the Commando first because it's uh, more accurate. Then we'll switch to the RPG or the Room Sweeper if I'm, no, if I'm just gonna be spraying. Wait, where do I need to go? Up there. Get into the XMAT labs. Yeah, I need to go there anyway. Dreaming High, also up there. Okay, so that's gonna be next time. Because in here... No, actually, up there... There's some shops which I'll handle in the off time. Not me. Yeah, I'm gonna stop here because the shops are over there and I need to go over there. Into the corpse zone. Hmm. Oh, there's a, someone who wants to give me a side quest. Alright, alright. Though it pains to ask, you just might be able to help. I mean, import export business, you see? I buy and sell water. Luxury water. The very best. And only to the very best people. Well, perhaps buy isn't quite the right word. More like borrow. The water goes to the top, the very top, to the pinnacle, of course. Well, my quite discerning clientele want, dare I say, expect only the most extraordinary of water tasting experiences. We seem to be running a bit low at the moment. However, so I was thinking, perhaps you could make a chip for me, replenish my stock. Sure. Wonderful. Now, I doubt that your rather blunt taste buds and your ahem, ahem, quite barbaric sense of smell will scarcely be able to appreciate the finer qualities of my water, so dubbed the elixir of the gods, by my also discerning clientele. But the thing is, you don't even need to taste the stuff, as it really is easy enough to identify. The water comes from a bathhouse, you see, specifically the bathing pool where all the Carlins like to relax after work. <laughs> we don't know what it is exactly, but there seems to be something about those Carlins just sitting there, sweating away, detoxing as it were, and thus we got all that residue just floating around in the pool. That, mixed with groundwater, the natural sediment, whatever else, gives us the elixir of the gods. That's what they say. So all you have to do when you find is simply head to the bathhouse, and look for a bathing pool with an abnormally high concentration of carlins having a dip. Collect a sample from there and bring it on back. Easy enough. Uh, Gen 9 H2O. Ariel. Ariel is a Jachlin water merchant. Ever heard the phrase, I wouldn't sell you the sweat of a dead dog's balls? Well, Ariel would absolutely sell you the sweat of a live Carlin's balls. Of a whole bunch of Carlin's, in fact, and that is exactly what 
what what he does when he sells coal and bathwater used to the uber-rich way up in the pinnacle, at the top of the arcology. Some will claim that Ariel's certified Carlin Aguapura tastes like anything you'd get out of a reasonably clean faucet in the low halves, but those uncouth detractors are clearly not in possession of the oh-so-refined palate required to appreciate what the high habers in the pinnacle call the elixir of the gods. But that's neither here nor there. What is here is the fact that, though, that Ariel, as of this moment, is running a little low on supply, so it looks like you're gonna have to stop him up find that bathhouse and find those garlands. Next time. That's it for me. I actually need to go to work. Because this was a very early stream. So, are you quitting? Okay. Uh, see you next time. Stay good. Have fun.